version 16.2 is here. We have a UX focused release for you with several handy improvements. First are multi edit quick filters. Say you tag an item with several options in your multi select list. With this new feature, click here to filter down to a specific selection so you only see what you need in the grid view. Next is a remaining estimate update. Select an item and then hit D on your keyboard. Now anytime both fields are blank when you open a new or existing item, Axosoft will update the remaining estimate field automatically when you enter a value for the initial estimate field. Keep in mind if you explicitly state a value for the remaining estimate field, then Axosoft will respect that data moving forward. Team filters are now available for your burndown charts in the standup. Access this menu here to enable your team filter and then update the burndown chart accordingly. 16.2 includes multi-select options for when you navigate to tools, people, users. You can now activate, deactivate, or unlock multiple users at once by right-clicking and accessing this menu. Speaking of bulk updates, copying, moving, and duplicating multi-selected items are now available in Axosoft limit up to 100 items. We have added one additional place for adding work logs. If you navigate to your work logs tab, right click on an existing record to add a work log. You can also use a keyboard shortcut W. Next, we reworked the back end for audit trails so that it tracks system changes to include projects, releases, users, and more. Lastly, we did update the organized panel and the details panel so that they fly open or close when you click on the arrow icon. That about covers what's new in 16.2. For more videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we'll see you in the next release.